Welcome back, everybody. We are at the award ceremony, finally. So I am going to turn it over to Andy, who is going to give you the results for the women's snowboarding. Absolutely. Snowflakes games have been awesome here today at Liberty University. And for fourth place in the rail jam for the women's was Amelia Steltzer. You. She did an awesome job today throwing down. And in third place, hitting that podium spot, Joanna Carr. Joanna also doing a great showing. And number two spot, Addison Gardner. Great showing from the girls. I was really impressed today with all the tricks they threw down. Uh, but coming out on top in the women's rail jam is Adriana Morone. And uh, not only did Adriana take home that top spot on the podium today, but she also took home best trick with a backside nose press to fakie. Well done, Adriana. That was an awesome trick, and uh, it was a blessing having you here today. As we see the girls just celebrating up on the podium. Yeah, give them a round of applause. They did an awesome, awesome job putting on a great show. <laughs> and next, we have the women's Big Air, a.k.a. Big Scare. But uh, they weren't scared as they were charging today. And in fourth place, Addison Gardner, honorable mention. Well done, Addison. And in third place is Sydney Beatty. Yeah, Sydney, good job. Got to love the big checks. Someone always loves getting it. <laughs> it doesn't matter how much, but holding the big check is always a good thing. And in second place, Chandler Petal. Yeah, Chandler, pulling out that second place spot. <laughs> And today's woman coming out on top in the big air is Chelsea Zacker. <laughs> Chelsea also putting down today a massive backflip for best trick also. Give a round of applause for all three of these girls sit on top of that podium. Well done. There's your po point system. Uh, Chelsea getting a total points of 171. Awesome. And then to follow them up was the men's snowboard rail jam. It was an incredible event. The guys were throwing down. And in third place, no stranger to this mountain at all, Ryan Leeds. Yeah, Ryan, also the head coach here for the Liberty Snowboard team. <laughs> Someone track down that man. Get him on that podium. Collect a big check. Yeah, Ryan, well done, buddy. And in second place, a 14-year-old, Luke Winkleman, putting on an incredible performance, stomping all kinds of tricks, a great variety, very clean. Probably had the best overall average for stomping tricks. And in that number one spot, Jesse Paul taking out the snowboarder rail jam. Congratulations to Jesse standing on top. Great showing, going big. And probably one of the gnarlier things we saw today in the rail jam stomped was a 270 lip slide from the pole jam to the elbow. And that goes to Jesse Paul.
How's that big check feel, Jesse? <laughs> and there you get to see board slide 270 out on your screen. Is uh, Next, we're going to take it over to men's. Actually, we're going to uh, throw it over to Steel Spence to the skiers rail jam. Thank you, Andy. <clears throat> yeah, man, we had an incredible competition out here today. All these guys threw down some incredible tricks, uh, very high level of competition under bluebird skies. And uh, so without further ado, I'm going to give you top three for men's rail jam. Coming in at third place, having one heck of a day is Kellen Baker. Come on up, man. Yeah, a lot of consistency, so many great tricks thrown down, and, uh, and an excellent showing today. Coming in in second place, please give it up for Sam Miles. Great job today, Sam. And uh, it couldn't have been a better day. That was a very, very exciting rail jam uh, with a lot of little swapping around there at the end on the uh, four-run format. And so please welcome your day's champion to the stage, Mr. John Steltzer. <laughs> These guys put it down today for some big money uh, and stiff competition. So nice work today, John, Sam, and Kellen. Great work, guys. Give these guys a round of applause. We take a look back to the big screen. We got some Stelzer highlights here with the 2-7 on, 2-7 off continuing. A huge bag of tricks that it took to win this today. For this guy's two, that's two, but he got it in the end. And you always gotta love that uh, competition between the Stelzer brothers. They have had an incredible showing over the years. Uh, but back to the men's snowboard, Big Air. Uh, wow, we saw some wild tricks thrown down. I got to get a big shout out to my man, Seth Carlsworth. He was just charging day. He took home a pretty good raspberry on the cheek. But um, yeah, awesome doubles and crazy rail tricks. But uh, third place, we saw him on the podium in the rail jam. And we see him here in third place is Luke Winkleman. Only 14 years of age. Charging, very clean. We saw the front sev and the back sev with a very smooth style. Well done, Luke. And in second place, going big all night, taking it deep into the landing, is Ben Sulo. Yeah, Ben was going off tonight. I believe last year's champion, but still right there on the podium. Chipping right at the heels of tonight's big winner in the big air for men's snowboard, number one, Yell Kusino. Yeah, Yell, throwing down, earning that top spot. Well done. And also tonight, earning the big air best trick. With a double backflip, taking it deep in the landing. Ben Sulo, best trick, check it out. There's the backside. Seven with so much style. The floaty backflip, Kevin, and there's that drunk driver. I believe that was a nine, and there's the 1260 attempt from Yell getting after it. Awesome showing, guys. And to close out the night, was the skier still take it away? And it was an exciting final for the men here on the big air this evening. Uh, Battle of Brothers was going down hot. We saw so many tricks go down, multiple switch tens, some dub cork tens, some dub 12 attempts. Uh, so one amazing evening of, uh, of big air. So starting with third place, please welcome back to the podium, Kellen Baker. Yeah, Kellen brought a good bag of tricks. Nice, clean switch sevens and zero spin in there. So great work tonight, bud. 
Second place, John Steltzer. With a heated battle, battle for first with his brother. Throwing down some switch, uh, what do we have here? Switch nine, switch 10 stale, one of my favorite tricks of the evening. And your winner of the evening, Mr. Tim Stel Steltzer, bring it up, man. Congratulations to all these guys. We're gonna go to the monitors and uh, watch what it took for Tim to take this win today. Congratulations, guys, competing for big bucks. And under the lights this evening, Tim comes in with some Switch 10 action. We got a double flat spin 720, one of the tricks that helped seal the deal for him. And then stepping it up as the night went on with the Del 12 safety, squeaking it around and couldn't quite put it to his feet. His feet. Yes, that's a wrap for the night, huh? You, you. Amazing day today. Yeah, it was absolutely fantastic. Great riding, great friends, great people. It was a really good time. I really enjoyed both of you guys. Absolutely, it was a pleasure. Yeah, so uh, thanks for joining us. Thanks for tuning in. Um, it's been <laughs> absolutely fantastic, and uh, I, I look forward to the next time we can do this again, all get together. Yeah, big shout out again once again to our sponsors, uh, Played Against Sports, and uh, Under Armour, got Pepsi, Snowboarder Mag, and New Schoolers, man, making it possible tonight. It was an amazing day. You guys were throwing down. Um, I can't believe some of the this, this stuff we saw, just like the backflips off the uh, cannon rail onto the elbow. Yep. Uh, all the doubles. I think that's the most doubles I've ever seen at the Snowflex game. So uh, big shout out to all our competitors out there tonight. They were really charging, putting their neck on the line. Yep, and of course a thank you to the Snowflex Center staff and events for putting this incredible event together. Absolutely, yeah. For, uh, for everybody coming and checking it out, thanks for giving us all the time and, uh, and, and joining us. It was, it was really fun. And the fans that came out, man. Yeah. Shout out to Lynchburg, dude. Come out here, support the guys, cheering them on. You know, you got to love all the camaraderie. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, on behalf of all of our uh, hosts here, to a great evening. Thank you guys so much, Lynchburg. And uh, have a great evening. Yeah, we'll see you next time.